Monk being Pekko, being Haze, Haze being right, yeah. uh, Pet Monk, being um, Infernape, for example. Um, I recently, oh, trapped, oh, recently trapped Seth dueling, uh, duoing the, the Falco, the Falco. Right? Yep, 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 yep. Look at you. Yeah, basically. That's research. So we have a couple. So I, I do know the, the game plan for Diddy Kong most of the time. And we are, we are clapping. Uh, yes, clap for yourself. If no one else will, you should. Ooh. Poppy swinging like that. You're going to get hit by the up tilts, by the bananas as well. Uh, you know. Of course, now with the deep reading, not doing too much that first time, but of course, we can get as many times as they want, as long as they see fit. And at the moment, they're seeing a couple of side beats coming their way. The fair not hitting its mark, but again, the deep reading's online. All John numbers have to do, take a deep breath, get back into the game, maybe get some sanitation as well. John numbers pretty much, yeah, you're right, you're right. The game plan is to get deep breathing, the game plan is to get a little bit of healing from the sanitation and the deep breathing in general. And just kind of negate Diddy's plan. John oh gets the God. header, gets a spike. It it spikes. It has two hitboxes on it. I don't know what to tell you, buddy. And I believe the spike is like at the back of the head as well. So just as you, you know, they were waiting for kind of an air dodge. Really smart numbers to wait for it. Get the spike right there. And honestly, uh, take a big lead. Yeah, this is where numbers was really comfortable. Um, he loves being off stage. He loves being oh, yeah. playing that ledge. We he honestly almost pioneered it even. So it's up to Nelvin to get that confidence and just honestly, like, you know, just just fight numbers off stage a little bit. Diddy Kong can in fact do that to a certain extent. That down air is there is a is a great move for a reason for Diddy Kong. But these up tilts, these double hitboxes, the up airs, they're landing beautifully for numbers. And the soccer ball to boot is also a big space to, uh, a space taker. Yeah, and you can't be plucking banana in unsafe spots like that because numbers will smack you with the head of uh, the soccer ball or with the uh, sal sun salutation. Entire sun is gonna come towards your way, whether you like it or not. I don't know what to tell you. Oh, big. Oh, well, can we take it? Okay. Banana in the hand as well. Again, deep reading straight away off the platform. Means business. Dumber trying to get something. Just turns around, hits him with the other part of the uh, the F-Tilt, the actual sweet spot part. That is going to take the stock. And again, deep breathing on board. So, you know, don't want to be near them anytime. You absolutely don't. And now we've seen John Numbers kind of get really comfortable. The deep breathing is still active for a little bit longer. You can see where she's a the slight red tinge on We Fave. You can't tell. But it makes her it makes her heavier, it makes her run faster, it makes her uh, let, take less knockback. She hits harder. She basically gets everything in the kitchen sink with deep breathing. A very great mechanic. But Nelvin is starting to kind of pick up the pace a little bit. Not getting much percent on himself, but trying to negate Numbers' opportunity to get the W. I'm telling you, man, John Numbers feels so confident on that ledge. I'm you know, all they have to do in New York is add that ledge to the subway station. You know I mean, it'd be a great honestly, uh, line for them, honestly. Because at the moment, the way the numbers feel so comfortable on the ledge, it also lives and dies by it too. Nelvin finally doing something in the set. Uh, taking actually, you know, uh, the same stock now, but the percent wise still in numbers favor. Yeah, these triple platforms, I, want, I don't want to very light touch on the tri the triplat we do have uh, going on on regular Battlefield. This allows you know, Nelvin to just kind of run around and kind of do whatever he wants around John Numbers, and John Numbers kind of he either has to uh, you know, chase chase him out or weigh him out, just like that. Beautiful up smash uh, connection, and that sends Nelvin to above 100%, which is really scary against the deep breathing John Numbers. Trying to get down there, but maybe a bit too greedy, and now you just just flinging yourself off the stage, and Numbers like, you know what, we're in my domain. You know, taking that first game very handily. I'm telling you, bro, they're gonna need to add that ledge uh, as a subway station. You know. Listen, some Scary. some some stations do have a ledge. Some of the outdoor ones. That's where that's where John is. That's what you gotta do. He's just chilling. What are you gonna do about it? Nothing. Nothing is nothing, gonna be done about John Numbers on this ledge. And you know, honestly, I do want to say Nelvin uh, tried his best to. Ooh, great song choice. Try his best to. Contest numbers off stage. Try to get that Diddy Kong, that patented Diddy Kong downer that would definitely spike you at any other time. But the problem with John Numbers is one, he's expecting it, and two, that uh, up B gives him invulnerability. Not invulnerability, but he has a, 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 a shifting hurt box sure. and, and hit box that if you get hit by the the arms, you can't down air him unless you time it perfectly. Good start from Nelvin so far, though. I stay away from my ledge though. Again, plucking the banana in not exactly the safe position, and you're kind of just giving numbers another item. He's already got soccer ball and, and sand sanitation. Don't give him a third one. That's just greedy. I mean, he has a whole tutorial on how to pick up Diddy Banana. He does not care. It applies to every item in the game. He knows how to utilize it in his own fashion, and he knows how to grab it out of your hand and render you kind of useless without that uh, that you know that pivotal use the utilization of um, Diddy Kong's kit. The soccer ball is not going to get anything along with the forest match, but that shield damage is impeccable. And then, uh, yeah. Another spike. Yo, stop Sorry, going production. to the ledge. Sorry, production. 
Like, if Everyone. you ain't got your Metro card, stay away from that bro. You can't go to that station. I'm telling you, bro. Numbers, oh. absolute terror over there. Leave that domain alone. You don't want to enter that zone. Your unlimited Metro card? Give it to me. Re Please. Not the instant replay. Oh, my goodness. Instantly picked up Brunson by Housing 3000 Technology. Of course, uh, the best in the business. As we get started onto the second stock for Nelvin. He's trying to get rid of this first dog, trying to go feed down on the ledge, but Numbers having one of the best ledge hangs, ledge hangs in the game, it just makes it so much harder for anyone to contest him even then. I never thought I'd call WeFit the savior, but you know, defeating the evil right now, Nelvin in so much trouble. Anytime they get something started for them, Numbers puts that to bed. They don't even need a deep breathing until now. Get up smash Nelvin, trying to get something back. Uh, and not too much down in percent. We were gassing numbers up, but Nelvin can definitely do something this game too. This is a great start for Nelvin as well. Perfect opportunity to get rid of some numbers in stock. We also have, oh, at the time, only had about 34% on us. Now it has been doubled um, by John Numbers with the deep breathing active, with also with some citation at, uh, to boot. But Nelvin still putting it all, uh, putting his all in this. This bandit in his hand can be narrowly interrupting, but not fully negating the deep breathing. So John Number is now a more of a threat than pot than uh, ever before. Okay, and again, now Number's trying to contest a lot of the time that, you know, Diddy's got a projectile out, and you don't want to contest Banana. That's no, a transcendent don't. item, bro. You cannot stop yes. that thing unless you catch it. <laughs> it's a transcendent item. I'm going to start calling it that. Potassium Thank you. Potassium power, bro, for real. There's a dash attack off the Banana trip. Number said, you know what? Come to my home now. I'm on the ledge. Have you got your Metro card out? You don't? Okay, stay away from me. Oh, base soccer ball coming in. The banana is going to be thrown. Not getting the up smash. Jumpers just kind of there. They you know daintily jumping right over game. The F to, to boot. And why are you standing there? What are you standing there for? Just let it rip. Why not? Why Let's not? Let's get it going. Back to deep breathing mode. And Nelvin very comfortable now taking the lead. But again, how long can he keep it for? No conversion off the nair. Oh, big talk about bigger sun citation, but not going to be able to find the connection. <laughs> my barrels! My cabbages! That's exactly what I thought of the entire time. Don't look at me like that, Devin. Don't look at me like that. <laughs> I'm being stared at and judged. That's what I thought of. But we are still one talk a piece. Still game two. The, top, the timer has been trickling down. Less than four minutes to go for numbers to secure this victory or for numbers to start bringing a, bringing a, Ooh, okay. a comeback. I like that double nair as well, getting like the kind of the bottom hitbox uh, to keep the, the combo going. Nothing too strong off of it. And now a decent lead to maybe take this game back. Numbers got to work. It's a little bit harder if he wants to you know, maintain this lead at the moment though. Nelvin saying no. Oh, I love the the back and forth that happened there, but the banana into dash tag gonna be taking it now. Deep breathing is inactive oh, no. for a while. Banana is still in hand, so you see nothing kind of scrambling uh, for deer. Let to find a way to interrupt this uh, this grab, this hold that numbers had on on the banana. Oh, it, it just didn't reach. My fault. That was so close. And again, of course, the sanitization, the charging part does have a win box. If you didn't notice, it does push the banana away. I don't know if numbers knows that to kind of do that as a strap, but either way, it was pretty smart. I'll give him the credit. Uh, Dev is telling me that he does know that, so very interesting. Alright, Deep Breathing is active. This is looking really, really scary for Nelson here. You may be evil, but are you nefarious is what the real question of the day is. Can we get numbers? Can we wait out the Deep Breathing? Can we not get hit by the Sun Citation? I also want to mention that it's almost impossible to really time out We Fit because of the fact that you can self-heal. So a lot of these little factors make it a lot harder for Nelvin to just take it, but man, as I say that, we secure the victory with the patented Diddy up smash. Yes, sir. I think Nelvin did his home at that time. Did some little bit of revision. He understands the exam now. I don't need to be anywhere near that ledge. If we're in the stage, in the center stage, what can we fit really do against Banana? You know, you can yeah. shit away with the win box. Cool, that's kind of cute. Either way, that you're still getting smacked up, tripped up, and sent to the blast zone. Nelvin, way more, uh, you know, kind of applicable in what he wants to do with the game plan. And it was proving to fruition in that second game, bro. 1-1 one, one now. So the second replay where John was just kind of standing there and then he got like up smash for it is hilarious. He, <laughs> he looks just runs like, up. He, he looks like his controller. Big thumbs up Big too. thumbs up. I love good sportsmanship. No, it was just, he just looked like he was just standing there goofing around. But going into game three, we're one to one. Guaranteed game four by this point. We're in best of five territory for anyone that's just, that is just tuning in to John Numbers and Nelvin. Um, we're staying on Battlefield, which is also I, I want to talk about. No stage of uh, Connor Trace, no nothing. The confidence is there for Nelvin and by default, John Numbers. Are you dead already? Yo, wow. deep breathing Whoa. is nasty. Well, I told you, it does everything in the kitchen sink. It who, does your taxes. Who knew that all you it have to drives. do is take a deep breath? Just take a stop. Guys, that's what you need to do, guys. You know what I mean? Just take a deep breath. It nasty. turns the game to survival horror, absolutely. Oh, we get up. We spot dodged? Okay. I and see. Just like that, uh, what a way to kick off the first stock of this third game now, because 
now you have to keep chasing numbers. And do you really want to chase Weefa all around the joint when they're going to be at the ledge having their own fun? Breathing on you and stuff? Breathing on you? <laughs> at the function of breathing on your neck, this is what Weefit does every single time. Ooh, trying to read a tech roll towards the edge of the stage, but instead, numbers decided to stay for a delayed getup instead. Love that approach from Numbers in order to avoid getting a smash. Now Nova is going back into the air, buddy. Okay, we did not have the deep breathing. The Numbers did not want to go for the up air, but we might go for it instead here. No, Barry Nova's life a little bit longer. My fault. We go for the peanut gun, a little bit extra damage as well, and also just making some space for the both of them. A little bit of a Q set with the soccer ball, gonna change the angles depending on the move used to hit the ball after. But Nelvin, do understanding that, you know what? I'm gonna stay just away from the ledge, clap it up, see if we can get the stock as well. Oh no. Oh, you saw the, you saw the runoff down there coming in from Nelvin, but Numbers able to negate it pretty efficiently. And the rare we fit down tilt kill. The knees, but it hurt. Ooh, big, ooh, you heard that big deep breath she took? You're cooked. Okay, foot still gonna push from the ledge just a little bit more. And there's the down there, finally! Nelvin says, you know what, I do have a Metro card, I found it in my wallet, it's ready! I'm on the train tracks now, we're doing something! I'm on the tracks? <laughs> we're gonna be seeing a dash tag game completely with by, the, by, uh, by John Numbers, a second one to boot. Oh, the wow. down toes from Diddy Kong, they're, they're used for a reason, they're so good, good at kind of carry. Yeah, for sure, the, the spacing from Nelson has been, or from Nelvin has been improving steadily throughout these games. And a lot of the thing is that I feel like a lot of Diddy's are kind of used to kind of hitting these marks on the side B's, whether it's the grab or the actual hitbox, but Numbers is doing a good job of shutting down that side B, not letting it happen at all. Haven't seen too much uh, success from the side B from Nelvin so far, and I feel like that's on John Numbers' side, understanding, you know what, if you want to be in my zone, uh, i got a couple of projectiles to stop you in your tracks. Big quarter coming from Diddy Kong. Nelvin has the opportunity to get the get the uh, the downer, oh, but it's going to be hey, the, uh, the monkey flip, <laughs> monkey flip into the header. Oh, they're talking. All right. I think John like just like abruptly gets up. He's like, "Excuse me, are you ready to go for the next one?" <laughs> side B dunk after side B dunk. I think he's found three so far now. Yes. I mean, you're getting dunked on. Like three games, dunked three dunks. Yo. <laughs> it happens. Listen, we're going back and maybe running it right back. I didn't quite see the stage selection, if anything, but. If these past three games have told me anything, they're going back to Battlefield, and they absolutely are. Three platforms at our disposal, and uh, oh my god, a huge John Numbers fan. Thank you, for Number, for, subs uh, for subscribing with Prime, I believe, right? Prime is so cool. He gets subscribed by Prime. But John in Integers, uh, we have to call him the alternate universe of John Numbers, is out and about, and he's playing a little more evilly than evil Nelvin can right now. But we are seeing Nelvin lead for so, so far. His evil name when it should be Jimmy Figures. I'm gonna start calling that from now on. Jimmy way, what? I like Jimmy figures. Either way, Jimmy. we're gonna see if John or Jimmy can do something right now. At the moment, getting kind of smacked up again. Uh, another burst of momentum from Nelvin. Maybe showing some signs of life. Another few claps on the, on the, on the ledge. Down have been really good space-wise so far in the set, but John Numbers otherwise have been putting a stop to this whole Diddy's game plan. Now you're off stage again. A little mini sun as a tree. A little, a little bit of a, a star, even not quite a sun yet. Trying to get that the uh, the the, the force match there, but not gonna be able to connect either way. Still gonna be Nelson in the lead. Oh, oh, we fumbled a little bit, but it wasn't your fault. It is okay. It happens. And I like that on John Numbers. Just simple things like that to turn turn around and get the F tilt on the punish to put him up in the air. Doesn't want he wants the other hitbox as well. Uh, just smart things like that. So effective. Okay, love that pick up on the up smash and or after John uh, kind of whiffed on the F tail on shield. Your own banana does betray you. We go for the forward throw. Doesn't quite kill, but we definitely try going runoff for the fair. Not gonna be able to get anything though, and we are a little bit scared. You saw the down throw into the spot dodge, but I love the drop. Uh, um, I'm sorry, the throw of the banana upwards into the up smash. Beautiful uh, connection for Nelvin. Really interesting that John Numbers got the trip earlier on, but went for a grab instead of like kind of a kill. Maybe it's autopilot or not, but either way, actually kind of cost him. I thought like they could have killed, but now uh, it's kind of a different story now with Nelvin taking the lead. For sure, and now Nelvin, yeah, still the lead at 167%, 181 after the hit. And this is going to be where Nelvin has to really make it or break it. Oh, a whole new stock to play with. You have 0%, you have tripod at your disposal. Um, numbers is at deep breathing though, so anything Numbers does, uh, as I say that, now you're back to pretty yeah, much even, if up not. Tilt. In yeah. the side B, we're looking for like, Smash 4 again. Okay. So many combos coming out of nowhere, but still, uh, we fit. Or John Nelvin trying to build back the damage, bringing it back to even, and actually taking the lead. And healing yourself. 
Uh, I show garbage to subscribe as well. Thank you so much, Bestie. My I'm um, big fan, big fan. Numbers off stage. We see Nelson, uh, Nelvin trying to contest him, but thankfully neither one gets out. Uh, gets out with uh, with lost <laughs> stock. Oh my goodness, could've, it really could have gone either way. Yo, John Numbers nearly killed himself on the catch up banana. That was mad greedy, but still, uh, Nelvin doesn't make him pay. He's not that evil, apparently. Oh oh oh! Back air on shield, going for the forward instead. Ooh, we had the banana. My banana is gone. We're going for the down throw into the forward. Ooh, John Numbers off stage. What are we gonna do now? Can we make it back? Oh, we absolutely can. She has great verticality on that up B. I always forget about it, but Lena is set up on the other side of the stage, and the and the soccer ball honestly comes through. Ooh, looking for that other part of the hitbox with the up B, trying to hit him off the side, but can't find it. There's the down there, just putting him to the side. If it's not downwards, you go outwards, apparently. Uh, crazy move, doesn't even know if that's a sweet or sour move, but either way, it's a good flavor for Weefit Fit until now. Burst, or sorry, not sorry, Burst. Uh, Nelvin bringing it back to one stock apiece this game four. I did learn uh, that down there has, uh, the first three frames are always a spike. I learned that. Okay. It's horrible. We're going back into the game, however. Nelvin now at 45%, DP think is still active on John Numbers, but now it is gone. Like the dinosaurs. We're going straight back into our scrappy nature. The banana is still in Nelvin's hand. He's trying to find something off of Monkey Foot. There we go. And ah, DP is still back on the line. Now the forwarder to make it a clean 64% on Nelvin, who has brought it right back to an even percentage. I like that reverse F tilt to put him up in the air again. Just wants that uh, control, that advantage state. Nelvin putting a stop to it straight away. Trying to get the banana trip. Can't find it. Now the trading hits either way. But we're getting closer to the ledge mark. We know who wins over there. Oh, oh, great. Cr okay, great cross up actually going in front and center in the back of the John, the John Shield. I haven't seen him, uh, Nelvin fall victim to the, the cross up on John Shield and getting hit with, with the frame six back here. So nice dash back of the forward. So the, the deep breathing is still active as well, but now it's gone. Going for the forward throw. Thankfully, Vifi does not have any kill throws. So we have a lease on life for Nelvin. I don't know what was going on with numbers. Is that being a missing put? Either way, they, again, they didn't die. They're very close to. Banana up in the air, trying to make sure they kind of mix up with what they want to do. Another banana plucked straight away, but it's in Numbers' hands. Doesn't kill with it, but it's just utilizing it very well, keeping it away uh, from Nelvin. Damn! What? Yo! What? That was so unconventional, but you know what? If it works, it works. He ricocheted it off the stage and just upbeat him. Nelvin, you're cracked. You're actually kind of crazy. I didn't even know what happened until I just saw I'm looking at the replay right now. We see Numbers. Okay, we whiff a little bit. Numbers got hit by the banana, and then we were trying to recover back to stage anyway. So, like, why not just two, shoot two birds with one stone? I like that. Okay, we have game five. A very, in my opinion, a little bit of an unexpected game five. Where I felt like it looked like Numbers was very much in control of what was going on for a majority of the, of the round. But I feel like Nelvin is starting to be able to pick up on the habits that John has, or... Um, his stubbornness a little bit with that ledge play and kind of twisting it in a way that Diddy can work with it. It seems like John or Jimmy likes to get a lot of these uh, opening gambits with that, just like that, right? So many opening gambits. Can I get it? Can I get it? replay for that? And then and then Nelvin will bring it back to even for some reason. I don't know what really happens, but it always seems to be numbers, all figures right now pushing on ahead so easily. What happened here? Okay, we jump off, and then we. Telling you, bro, another spike. Add it to the tally, guys. I'm sorry. Another spike. I'm How sorry, many? what did he die at? Zero? I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm so sorry that We Fit exists. Thank you, Replay produ uh, Reaper Production. <laughs> Austin 2000 for the production, for the replay. Because uh, I low key missed it. Oh, you're dead as well? Bro, another anti Can I get instant game? replay on that? These game fives are just. <laughs> no one's got stamina anymore. <laughs> okay, oh, finally. Yeah! Now we're taking something back. I can't. I, I can't. You're right, these game fives, I don't know what goes on with everyone. We kind of just start uh, SDing. Nelvin is still off stage against Numbers, and Numbers just, is just maintaining this kind of wall he's put up with his own body. Uh, Nelvin opting to go over the wall, thankfully, but now we're on the other side of the stage, and Nelvin is, uh, again, being a victim to this wall that, that uh, Wii Fit has put up for herself. The Sun Citation does come up, the L Smash gets caught. That was the fastest game we've had so far. That was, uh, that was nasty ending to game five. <laughs> Whether it's John Numbers or Jimmy Figures, you just can't contest the man. That guy is invincible on the ledge. He wasn't even on the ledge when he got spiked. Crazy. You're right. I <laughs> Numbers is just built like that. We have instant replays for you guys. Here we go. We can see a, a quick rundown of the two-minute match we had just had. <laughs> <laughs> nice back air. Going. Yeah, yeah. You jump into it. Oh, you can't pluck like that. No. Nah. That's an autopilot pluck right there. Where are we going? Where are we going? Evil Nelson, no. Or I keep calling him Nelson. Evil Nelson, no. And this is just sad. This is sad. You just gifting freebies, man. Damn. 
He said I want to go home. I respect it. Alright, we, uh... <sighs> I'm shocked I actually clanged. Oh my goodness. Oh, we have replay on replay technology. I can't deal with it. I like that. So he actually hit the down there and was like, you know what? It hit my sudden temptation. Let me get a redo. Let me get yeah. a run back. So he does another down there. This time actually spikes in that time. So another one's going to get something, but just couldn't finish the job. No, nah, and then you died at sub 100. Yuck. We fit. That did 27%. Yuck. No, nah, absolutely not. Okay, we do have a Jackal. We do have Burst coming up on deck uh, for the start of Loser's Top 6. Uh, should be a really fun time otherwise. So we're going to be seeing Wolf. We're going to be seeing Sephiroth.